Okay guys, it is 6 a.m. and we plan to go to a waterfall hike and there's like this also like springs type thing too up there. So it's like a four hour drive. So we're gonna head out. Are you ready to go? You're both very tired. We hiked the volcano yesterday and we both just needed sleep but we only got like five hours of sleep. So let's do it. We're gonna go get some caffeine and we'll be on the way. So let's go. Okay, so when I was doing research on what we should do when we came here, I saw this insane waterfall. So we are going there right now. It's like a four hour drive, so we woke up right at sun, sunrise. And look how crazy the view is from the Airbnb. It's actually insane. So come with us, let's go. It's gonna be kind of a trek to get there, but I definitely think it'll be rewarding when we see this waterfall because it's supposed to be humongous. So let's do it. Yeah, the trek, even from our Airbnb, is kind of intense. It's like a 10, 15 minute walk straight through the jungle in order to get back to just a normal road. But even that road, you can't even take a normal car to get there. So we have to park into this kind of sketchy parking lot and trust our car won't get sold for parts. So we're going now. Hopefully our car is not blocked so we can get it out again. So oh, this is gonna be a bit of a trek just to get there. Okay, and now we're back on like the street. You can already tell how like narrow the street is. A car can't fit in the street, you just can't. But you have to do these small little tuk-tuk cars that will take you and drop you off that we have to get on the way up. On the way down, it's quick enough that we can just high check it down. But yeah, it definitely is very different than what we're used to. But yeah, we're almost there in the car. Probably another three, four minutes. Look at this view, just insane. Okay, now we just got to the car parking place. The doors are closed. It's like 6 a.m., no one's here. Uh, uh, English. Yes. Okay, I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. No, you're fine, you're fine. Okay, uh, I am planning. I have money for... Okay, I'm we're trying sure. to figure out the car this rental. Is, uh, yeah, we're trying yeah, to figure this out. No, just uh, maybe... Uh, yeah. he, he said he's gonna open it. Yeah, I know, I know. Yeah. He said, you have to, you have to wait. Thank you. It's a risky, we're good. Mm. Okay. It's good morning. Yes, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Sorry. Thank you guys. Can't help you, please. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Okay, that was really bad. Those guys, we were basically locked out of the parking. And they were basically asking us for money and a ride. And they were looking at the camera really weird. So, definitely not the safest place. That's for sure. Okay, so we stopped, got breakfast. We were both so hungry. Um, and now we're about to get back on the road, so. It's weird, they give you like, Warmed almond milk. Cardia's every breakfast. Oat milk. Oat milk, right? Warm oat milk. I guess it's traditional. They eat, like, drink this before breakfast. It's actually really good. Yeah, it's very weird. Yeah. Not bad, though. But yeah, we're about to get back in the car and go, so. 
So we went the original way, right? And we couldn't end up finding the waterfalls and then we thought we knew where it was. We put the address in and it took us this complete back way that was supposed to be off-roading that was way too intense. And we basically already said we're not off-roading again today. The last thing we did was too sketchy, especially for the sedan. So we had to go back and go all the way back around. And now we're 14 minutes away from the waterfalls. So we're almost there. It took us a little bit longer than we initially planned for, but now we're both antsy just to get there and start the hike. So um, we'll be there literally in like 14 minutes. So see you then. Okay, so we just got here and it started raining out too. So all things are against us right now, but we did not just drive three and a half, actually it was more like four plus hours now to not do this hike. So we had to see this waterfall and it's coming down now. So we're gonna put on our rain jackets, try to keep the gear as dry as possible and gotta go. <laughs> yeah, Ali's not happy about this. But we did not come this far, we have to see it now. Okay, let's go. So we are gonna get going on this hike though. So you guys are going into the bag for now. I'll pull you out in a second, don't worry. I'll pull you out in a second, there we go. Okay, so we are on the hike now. It was a whole thing with like parking, we didn't have change, but we figured it out now. And now we are heading to the waterfall. We have our rain jackets on, trying to protect the gear that's inside. And they said now it's just a trek to the waterfall. But this is all super slippery. And here's a prime example of this guy's walking with machete. Freaking machete, dude, are you kidding me? So, it's so natural here. Yeah, but they said it's probably like, just a little bit of a walk to actually get to the waterfall. And there's a pool down below too, so we're gonna try to see what we can do. This place is insane though. And this kid is giving us a tour now, taking us there, which we definitely appreciate because there's no way we'd probably know how to get there. So let me catch up with the group so I don't get left behind. What's your name? David. David? Oh, God. Gracias, David, David for taking us. Yeah. We appreciate it. Yeah, a lot of these people don't like when you put a camera in their face, I'm not gonna lie, but still a cool experience. And he's definitely very friendly for taking us here. We did not drive four hours not to come see this place, so it'll definitely be worth it. Okay, so. Oh my gosh. Okay, so there's two different things, right? He has told us there's the waterfall on top and there's actually a pool down below. We actually were planning on doing another pool and it was like three plus hours away from here. So the fact that they have another pool that looks kind of similar to that one down here is just a bonus. So we're definitely gonna check that out after we do this, but yeah, you just gotta see this place because it's actually gorgeous. stronger and we're getting a lot steeper too so let's go see this thing there it is so we're gonna hike up all the way here and go to get right here oh goodness it's about to get wet holy cow dude 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 are you kidding me? Holy cow. This is the biggest waterfall I have ever seen. Holy goodness. Oh my God. Are you kidding? <laughs> The land is 
completely sucks, but I do not care. Holy cow. This is insane. <laughs> Woo, this is crazy. Holy goodness. Look how insane this is. Appreciate you. Appreciate you, buddy. Pueden tomar foto todo, ya ahí abajo hay piscinas para bañarse. Okay, okay, down. Down. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> this is just to show you guys. It might be a stretch to get to where you want to go, but this was so worth it. So we're gonna take everything off and actually go get in the water, take pictures and enjoy this place. We'll see you guys in a little bit. Holy cow. Okay, so I told Ali it's tradition. If you come to the waterfall, you have to jump in at the base. So we're going, the water is super intense. So we switched to the actual go kart, but you have to get in here. It's just too insane. Get right here. Okay. Ready? One, two. <laughs> goodness okay so i have my whole thing covered up into a shirt right now i don't even know if you can hear me because the mic's off because everything's wet we're gonna go down to the pools now because it's there's mist spraying everywhere it's raining that was so insane though okay we gotta get our stuff tripod and everything oh oh we're walking back there's literally caves everywhere in here too we're kind of trying to keep the bags as dry as possible. Now we're making our way down to the pools. So this should be really cool too. And the weirdest thing about this, this place is beyond stunning and there's no one here. No one here whatsoever. And how much is it per person? Um, 20 cues? 20 cues. Yeah. So I mean, if you average it out, it's probably like maybe like five bucks a person to come here to how like crazy this view is, I mean, actually insane. Okay, let's get there. Are you guys kidding me? This place is a hidden gem. So, we came down, and this is actually a hot spring, so this is all very warm. This, this is very nice. So, we're gonna enjoy this now. I think it's very well deserved after the past couple days we've had, but thank you guys for watching. Uh, I'll see you in the next one. I'll link everything that we did down below. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna enjoy this. <laughs> this is so cool.